Sir Humphrey Davy was a Cornish chemist and inventor who is best remembered today for his work on the isolation of iodine and the development of his famous miner's safety lamp. Humphrey Davy was one of the most brilliant scientists of the 19th century. As a young apprentice to an apothecary, he developed an interest in chemistry. His first post was at the Pneumatic Institution in Bristol, where he studied the effects of nitrous oxide, commonly known as laughing gas. In 1801, he was appointed to the Royal Institution as director of the laboratory and assistant chemistry lecturer. Between 1802 and 1812, he was professor of chemistry. Here, his work established the science of electrochemistry, and he isolated potassium, sodium, magnesium, barium, strontium, and calcium by electrolysis. He also carried out research into the tanning industry and agricultural chemistry, as well as observing the electrical arc. He was knighted in 1812, and in 1813 he appointed a bookbinder's apprentice, Michael Faraday, as his scientific assistant. Faraday, of course, would go on to become one of the most important and influential scientists in history. Davy toured the continent between 1813 and 1815 with Faraday. The IET archives hold some of Faraday's notebooks from this period, and these describe his travels in Europe. Davy's later successes included the isolation of iodine, the development of his famous miner's safety lamp, and his appointment as president of the Royal Society. In the 1820s, he advised the Admiralty on how to protect the bottom of their ships, and also worked on improving optical glass. In 1818, Davy was awarded a baronetcy. This was, at the time, the first such honour ever conferred on a man of science in Britain. Sadly, his health began to decline, and he suffered a serious stroke while in Switzerland in 1929. He died that same year in Geneva. Davy is commemorated with a tablet in Westminster Abbey and a towering legacy as one of the greatest scientific minds of all time.